All right, folks. Um, we're back with Raiden 4. Um, bad news, unfortunately. <laughs> I somehow managed to start this recording and then stop it two minutes in. And I didn't realize until I had played a good portion of the game. So, um, yeah, that's unfortunate. I, I just went ahead and deleted the the other video because it was mostly me just digging around in the menu and I guess I must have I know what it was I was trying to hit backspace to get out of a menu and I must have accidentally hit um, F11 which turns off the recording and I didn't notice that until like I just happened to glance over at my other screen and was like eh, how long is the video going and it was sitting at zero seconds and I was like shit so ah <sighs> anyway Let's, uh, let's see here. Um, if we go in here, we can change what character we play as. We can randomly play as the fairy. I don't know why. We're going to stick with the regular ship. We will try out the fairy, but for now we're going to stick with the regular ship. Also, we're going to... Um, I was doing overkill mode, but I didn't like it. Because um, it, it, like... Uh, very... Normal. And every, every enemy bullet can be destroyed by shots. Yeah, we'll go with regular easy. Um, Alright, yes, so we can choose what we want the purple thing to be. I tried that out, I didn't like it. It's basically the green laser from Raiden 3, except you get three of them. Didn't like it, so we're going with the regular thing. Also, I was real excited when I saw that um, the game had a, a 1080p setting in its resolution. And I was like, oh, amazing. And then I started playing and it's portraited on window box or letter box, whatever the hell you want to call it. Like we have this little slice of real estate. Um, but yeah, overkill mode uh, essentially after you kill something, the husk of it stays around, and you can keep shooting it, and it will give you some extra points. And uh, it was more annoying than anything because it would like it would block your shots, and if you were using the purple laser, it would fuck up the tracking of it, and it would just give you something else that you would potentially be tempted into picking up at a very inopportune moment. So that's why we're not doing that. Um, we are doing additional mode, which apparently has two extra stages over the arcade mode, which is, the arcade mode is what it was in, you know, the arcades, obviously, so we'll do additional mode, get the two extra stages. Um, yeah, very cool. I have no idea what in the heck they do. Um, all right, first boss. in there randomly. Uh, nothing too terribly fancy. I'm not horrible at it because I've... <laughs> uh, well, this guy isn't too hard to begin with, but... I've also fought him already. I'm very annoyed that that happened. Um, it's my own stupidity, though. I fat-fingered the the button when I was trying to hit backspace because I was in. Just like I said, I was messing around in the menus, and I, backspace doesn't even get me out of the menu. But I force of habit keep trying to do that so um also i don't know if i mentioned this before but next time a power up comes around you'll see a little blue circle going around the outer ring of it and when it gets straight up and down um that's when it'll change so it's nice that there's actually an indicator for when they'll change i didn't realize that until i was on like level three or yeah level three and i was like wow look at that 
So yeah, see the little thing rotating around it? When it lines up, it changes, so... Be a little bit more prepared with what you're getting. Ah, shit. Fairy, no! Also, I'm kind of digging the red weapon in this game. It seems pretty good. I know I don't normally go for it, but... Say the graphics are much improved from Raiden 3. I don't actually know how much time passed between the two games. have a second boss without some random drone trash, am I right? <laughs> um, this guy doesn't really shoot out a lot of drones, but he does detach into a bunch of different parts, so I guess that kind of makes up for it. Um, but it's funny, can you, oh fuck, I'll give you, I'll give you a guess as to what the third level is going to be, um, and if you guess water themed, you are correct! like a unwritten unwritten rule that the third level of every Raiden game has to be a water water based and like a harbor and have the boss be a boat <laughs> just kind of funny kind of like how the second boss has to whoa I don't like that has to um, shoot out lots of drones and detach and do stuff did it in Rain 1? Did it in Rain 2? Did he do it in Rain 3? I forget, but I know the third level was a water level in Rain 3. Um, and, uh, whoa. It just seemed like I blasted out a lot of homing missiles there. Um, but yeah, see? Water. <laughs> Harbor. Oh god, why did I do that? That was stupid of my part. Also, you might notice the familiar music if you watched the uh, Raiden X playthrough. Um, also, if you just look up a playthrough of actual Raiden 2, you'll hear the same thing, but um, I can't play that. Because, I, I mean, I think it's on consoles, but... For whatever reason, there was never a PC port, and I don't know why. And when I look for one, like, there's some, like, real shady-looking, like, download links for it, and I'm like, mm, I don't know about that. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> We're not doing that. Although I do have my PS2 emulator set up, so... I don't know if it was on the PS2 or not. Should have used the bomb. Um, yeah, it might be a worthwhile endeavor. I'll look and see if it's on the PS2. Because if that's the case, I could probably buy like a copy of it cheap off like eBay or something, and then uh, rip the ISO from the um, from the disc and load it into my emulator. You know, that's of course if it is on PS2.
Which, I mean, I don't see why it wouldn't be. Like, that was released in, what, the 1990-something? I'll have to look and see. I, I actually don't know when... when it was released. Hell, maybe it was on the PS1. I don't have a PS1 emulator. Although, I wonder. Is a PS, would a PS2 emulator be able to do the backwards compatibility bit with PS1 games? I don't know. That'd be interesting to see if it could. I'm gonna look that up, because now I'm curious. But again, I don't even know if Raiden 2 was ever released on, you know, the, the console. Pretty sure it was, because I've seen people, like, playing it. If you look on YouTube, there are people playing it. I, I know they didn't buy a arcade cabinet just to and then screen cap it. <laughs> uh, anyway, here's our water boss. Oh, God. Fine, this is fine. All good. Okay, that part's done. Yep. 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 Yikes. And we're not done yet. I don't like that at all. Or that. Okay, should be should be done. Yep, good. Okay. right here. Doing too badly. Right as I almost fuck it up. Okay. 
gotta say, I really love the little timer indicator thing that... Oh, God. Just scratching my nose. <laughs> that, uh, you know, tells you when... When it'll change to the next power-up. Kill these random. They look, almost look like Aztec statues. I don't know. Wonderful, more spider bots. Yeah, it seems like when I don't shoot for a little while. I, like, charge up. So, yes. Oh, what the fuck? What? What even just killed me? Oh, it's the bombs. It's the bombs from Raiden 3. Back again. Oh, God. Speaking of bombs one now. Oh god. whole don't shoot and charge up thing is interesting, but... Oh, what? Are you kidding me? If I don't shoot, it stops the power-ups from changing? What? Also, it gives me points. Yeah, look at that. It gives me extra points. crazy-ass pattern, and oh good, they're not dead, of course they're not dead. Alright, let's charge up. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. Alright, well there goes all of that. Yeah, wow! The charge up thing is interesting. It's a very interesting mechanic. And they don't even tell you about that. Right, if there was just one of these, I'd have no problem. But the fact that there's two... Can't say I'm a big fan. Alright, there we go. Hooey! That is a big rocket. Alright, yes, yeah, so we have to hold down shoot to get it to turn, change. And then I can just pause it. That is cool. Yeah, ho ho ho, flaming asteroids, alright. No, thank you. Oh, look at that. That's cool. We actually played through the uh, transition to space. Every other time, it's been a cutscene. Yeah, like, the charge-up thing is cool, but there's really... There's really no, like, place for it, as far as I can tell, because it's like, you stop shooting, you may as well just... 
like. You stop shooting, it just makes it harder. I guess if you really want a certain fuck me, certain type of power up, um, then don't shoot. But good luck actually getting close to pick it up. God damn it! Bomb. Yikes. Alright, good. Oh god, I almost flew right into that. Oh shit. Alright. Oh, jeez. It's also kind of funny to note that Raiden Legacy, aka the oldest one, had full controller support, and Raiden three and four don't appear to so not the controllers are particularly amazing but I feel like they're a little bit better for playing this than keyboard and mouse ideally using the mouse well not even keyboard and mouse then just the keyboard it's not keyboard and mouse ideally using the mouse uh, is the most precise. Um, and I find that I do the best at bullet hell type games when I when it has mouse control. Um, okay. But yeah, in a quiet, you know, a quiet moment when there's no enemies and you can stop shooting kind of like this, it's nice to just be able to unleash a little barrage of shit. God damn it. Well, it seems like there's unlimited continues. Either that or just a very generous number. Oh, I'm going to get run into the limit very soon. That's not the case. <laughs> oh. Evil spaceship. Hmm. Okay. Yikes. Ah, that's a lot of guns. Holy shit. Nope. Okay. Oh, fuck me, they're spinning. It's not a good trick. Don't try spinning. It's not a good trick. Not a good trick. And this is not pod racing. Okay. 
Now that we've got that covered. Whew. It's funny, it never occurred to me to stop shooting in any of these games before, because why on earth would you ever do that? Like, the game is just as much about dodging shit as killing it before it gets a chance to shoot you. It's much easier to dodge what isn't there. <laughs> So it looks like the rules for making a Raiden game are first level has to be some sort of big tank slash slow mech thing. Second level has to have a bunch of drones or detachable parts of the boss. Third level has to be water and at some point you have to go to space. Um, Because without fail, right, these big ass ship things are real pieces of crap. I do not like them, Sam. I am. I don't like those bomb things either. this satellite array? No? What the hell is this thing? Is it death laser? Like orbital death ray? Or is it just a space station? It's definitely not a moon. Alright, I'll stop with the Star Wars references. Ah, fuck. I can get a little carried away with them sometimes. Okay. Get too much stuff coming towards me there. I didn't need to do that. Maybe I did, who knows. Ah, should've used one there, that's for sure. Whatever the hell this thing is, it's big. interesting shape for a boss. I don't like that. No thank you. Alright. Oh, is it gonna spin? Is it gonna try spinning? She's been over that. Yeah, it's trying spinning. Okay. Oh, pinwheels of death. Okay. Oh, that's it? Okay. Works for me. Yeah. 
kamikaze people. No problem. Oh, there's the raw fuck. Yeah, there's the rocket. Alright, what's your story? Nope. I don't want to hear it. It's probably plagiarized anyway. Okay. Whoa! Busy paying attention to the power up and not. What? You just have tanks driving around on the outside of your rocket? And you just have all these random ass guns strapped to it? What the hell? Is this what Elon Musk's grand plan is? Make a giant ass rocket and strap a bunch of guns on it? that why he wants to go to space because he was basically like yeah when we get to Mars we're gonna make our own laws oh asteroids wonderful okay red asteroids too which don't look natural at all okay Care. I'm not buying what you guys are selling. Nope. Oh, thank you. Do not come again. I said don't come again. Alright. Can't take a hint. Jeez. Alright, back to the rocket. Okay, what now? Okay. Oh, Jesus! Who the hell... What the hell kind of rocket is this? Who puts spinning gun rings on their... What the f... What even... Baited into picking those up. Alright, I'll snag that one. Snag that one. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Those are some fast asteroids. Meteors, whatever the hell you want to call them. Asteroids. Yeah, they're asteroids, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, what's this? boss that's what it sounds like anyway it is very sh uh, shiny looks like one of those old school uh, oh, Jesus. underwater mines from like you know World War two or whatever with the little spike that man the little you know sp spike detonator things Oh, there's the, uh, the Raiden crystal. Yeah, I think, like, the Raiden is, like, uh, this, this crystal thing that, like, possesses, you know, like, a bunch of machines and shit or something. I don't know. I'll have to look up the lore behind these games, because I, I don't know. But I know, like, the, the crystal thing is, like, ultimately behind it all, and, like, possesses everything and controls it. Um, which is why it's the final boss in, like, every, every Raiden. Holy shit, that's a lot of crap. Take a chill pill, my guy. Jesus. All 
right. This is, uh... <laughs> what? Ah, this thing is wiping the floor with me in, like, seconds. That is so fast. Holy shit. Oh, it's dead. All right. Well, or is it? Nope. Nope. Not. No. Nope. Yeah. Hmm. Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh. Yeah, that, that thing was terrifying. Oh, the cutscene is in fucking full screen. All right. <laughs> oh, our aircraft carrier has seen better days. Wait. This is the first level, isn't it? this the first level? This looks like the first level. Play it for a bit because the cutscene there kind of... This... this is... yes? First level? I think so? I don't really remember. Yeah, it is. I remember that. And, like, I remember the airfield. Alright, well, it's just... So wait a minute, what the heck are the additional stages from additional mode? Because, were they, I guess they might have been mixed in the middle, because it can't have been like the last two, because that's like... Played a Raiden game without fighting the, the gem thing at the end, is it really a Raiden game? Raiden fighters don't count, because the gems are non-existent there. But yeah, this is level one again, so... No point, because we could literally, oops, we could literally, um, play that forever. Let's see. One, seven, two, one. Or is it? Alright, well, either way, we're being the fairy, because <laughs> if you give me an option as stupid as that, we have to try it. Um... I don't think it'll make any difference. Or will it? No, nope, there's no weapon that I can select. I can choose what I want, that's fine, we'll do that. Okay. So what does the fair- HOLY SHIT! That's cool. Alright, so what is the- Oh, what? Okay, okay. Why wow, the missiles are leaves? This is great! <laughs> uh, what do these do? Uh, same thing. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Hold on, hold on. My cough. Gone. Okay, what haven't we tried? We haven't tried that. What the hell? Flower power, baby! <laughs> oh my god. 
god, this is ridiculous. I do not like the purple at all. Get rid of it. The blue one is cool. Um. Hey, wait a minute. This wasn't blue last time, was it? No, not the flower power. Oh, God. Yeah, shoot the leaves at him. All right, blue. That's good. I don't think I've seen what the, uh... Wait, what? Hold on. Okay, that's the flowers. Gotcha. Alright, this is hilarious. I am glad I decided to try this. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, well. That's all well and good. Let's give the other ship a try, just for completeness sake. I doubt it'll be any different, but... Let's see, uh, yep, same, same thing. Yeah, it's exactly the same. Okay. It just is the, uh... I don't know. Older style of Raiden ship from Raiden 1. Or something like that. Alright. Well, that's Raiden 4. Overkill edition. I don't know. There's a bunch of, uh... Well, there's overkill mode, which I was telling you about. Where it's like, uh... Fuck, I may as well just show it. Um, you know, what's another couple of seconds? It's uh, it's the exact same um, missions uh, from the looks of it, from what I've seen. Um, but there's like these little weird metal things now. I don't think we had those before. And uh, yeah, see the ships don't die immediately and you can keep shooting them and you get overkill multipliers um which can take a surprising amount of damage like and it can uh, kind of bait you into um continuing to shoot something that you really don't need to keep shooting instead of dodging or shooting something else oh look at that level three um so that's why I, I, when I realized that my recording was screwed up, I switched to uh, additional mode. Oh, hello, fairy. Um, anyway, I am going to go look up a few things. Um, namely, if Raiden 2 was ever released on consoles, what console it was released on, and if I can find a disc of it for my emulator, I definitely will. Uh and also see what the hell the deal with these fairies are because i am curious now so um that'll do it for that'll do it for uh raiden 4 and uh when we come back we'll move on to raiden 5 so thank you all for watching and we'll see you then